Welcome back to Abs is Still. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, all my wonderful friends in YouTube verse. Oh, it's Ads O Steel reporting for Poopy Duty. A butt's worth of duty. Uh, we're gonna crank on eastward. Got a little extra time today, so hopefully, we can uh, make some progress. Make a little more progress than usual. Hey okay, now. First month of my new job down. <clears throat> Been friggin' exhausting. We're getting into groove though. Adjusted to the new schedule. Finding time to play and edit. Sleeping better. Getting the routine going. Bam. 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 I don't know where the fuck we're going. That is unexplored. We'll probably have to come back here, though. Let's go explore the rest for, for now. Let's go explore some more. Fuck. Um. Ah, I'm hitting all the wrong buttons. Hitting the dungeon buttons. Take some damage, huh? Maybe. Get one of these. Smack! <clears throat> yeah, that's right. Dealing with it. Holy fucker. Okay. <clears throat> That's what those guys do. Open. Can we open this? No. Is there any trash? No. Trash. What? There it is. Found it. Fuck yeah, advanced gear part. We really need those. Alright, we're in business. Need some fucking ammo though. Oh crap. Same. Why didn't they split up? I hit something. There we go. Okay. Get over it. Can you get treasure from those peeps?
Not like that. Not like that, you don't. Oh, I think I just have to shoot it. I don't think I can grab it. I gotta shoot it. Yeah. So that's the most you get is if you shoot it. Trash. Okay. I say, young lass, what do you mean by eyeing a man's fruit tree? Oh, hello. Uh, could I ask whether this is the glazy berry tree? As it is. I can infer that you and this gentleman aim to ensnare its fruit. We sure do. Back, back from whence you came. If you don't, I'm afraid you'll have to see me at my worst. No liking of friends of the treacherous beguilers. I shan't give them any fruit. And I shan't give any to you either. Wait right there. Sonic CM Punk, it's clobbering time. The Sonic CM Punk is here. Mr. The Sonic CM Punk, it's clobbering time. Ah, oh, well, if it isn't the princess. Still playing with your mechanical doodads, I see. Ha 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 ha! Fa 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 fa! Yes, um, the princess did indeed send me. Seems I may have been mistaken about you two saplings. I do say, Lily, are you referring to old Lee the Smokestack? One and the same. It's clobbering time. Oh, excellent. Just excellent. All right. Young lady, I'll let you partake of my fruit. Sounds creepy if you don't say it that way. Really? Now tell me, Tony, that scoundrel. See, still always going on about how he never loses. I always did have an inauspicious feeling about that boa. Someone needs to take that baby boa down a peg. Never did know what your grandfa- Grand? Grandfa? Um, meow, 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 meow. Yes. Grandpa, Grandpa, old buddy, old pal, old pal, you're so right. Now, now, then, where was I? You take this fruit now, you hear? Mix it right into a jam as soon as you're able. The taste will be absolutely spoiled otherwise. Fudge, yeah, give me that glaze bears. Wow, John, look, it's as shiny as glass. As it should be, I planted it after all. I have a green thumb. If you think it's that cheapskate Lee that's going to be partaking of it, the injustice. John, let's go back, John. Just wait till Lee gets a load of this. Oh fuck yeah! Hey, trash. Sweet hot trash. Don't look like it. I want to. Explore here. We'll go fight bosses and bad guys. Explore some more. Gotta walk our fucking butts all the way back here. Son of a Drangus. Okay, yeah. 
asshole. Fuck. Hell yeah. Quick draw, McSlaw. Quick draw. Quick draw. Oh shit. Finish this. Quick draw! Fuck. Oh. Need to put more um, skill points into quick draw. My talent tree. Mm, I'm leveling my talent tree. Mm. Liven. Have you heard? Have you heard? They say another word in the static of the television screen. It's a little rap I wrote. I rapped that line. A hip hopper. Eh, I'm a pretty famous hip hopper. I have a beatboxing instrument that I comp compose music with. My, it's my instrument. Ski rip. Script. Ski rip. Ah, oh, ski rip. Fucking nit monsters again. Anthropomorphized nit monsters. Sentient nips. Oh man, that thing shit out like probably eight or nine nips. Ugh, I've never seen a nipple come out of a bottle before. <laughs> oh fuck. You ever seen a. Never mind. Quick draw, McSlaw! Fuck, the nip got in the way. Shit. I don't want to smash any of these sweet little baby nips. Just kidding. Boom! Fuck you! <laughs> Ooh. Well, fuck you very much. Do I have to... Do I have to cook? Hmm. Not 100% sure what to do with this, but let's, let's get back to the area and see if we can... suss out ascertain our next move. Uh, pissy pants. Oh no. Pissy Pants McQueen? What are you doing here? Who's this goblin creep again? Ooh, I think he's dead. I think we, I think we uh, figured that out in a prior episode. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. It's these fucking shifty people. Hmm. I think he's lying. Oh, you cocksucking motherfucker. Glazy berries, we've got those right here. This 
Rapscallion, is asking us for our glazy berries because other dude with the purple necker chief that's a cool look um is is being faking being sick now because they want to swindle us out of our goods here take them you need more than us because they're they're preying on the, the innocence and naivete of our young protagonist sam Bullshit. Oh, uh, please. He only has one knife, two. This guy's a robot. Two. Wow, really? You're... I didn't even have to give you any more bullshit, and you just. John, we should go see William and make sure he's okay. Oh, you can't. I mean, um, the doctor. Yeah, the doctor's. He said no one should bother him right now. Doctor, we should we should definitely listen to the doctor then. When John was hurt, the doctor helped him too. He saved John's life. You should hurry back then. The doctor's probably waiting. If you need anything else, just ask, okay? We're staying in this house right here. Uh, yeah. Um. Anyway, uh, thanks. And you should feel fucking ashamed of yourself, Daniel the robot boy. The young android child. You guys are pretty great. Fucking go think about what you've done. I hope William feels better soon. Maybe she knows and she's big gaming him. Some 3D chess. Using his guilty and shame against him. It's a good move sometimes. Something that women are very good at. <laughs> oh, shit. Edit that out. Uh, edit that out. Edit out. Uh, 17 minutes. Toxic masculine. Viewpoints shared. Fucking ashamed of myself. Gonna have to go on apology tour. Definitely canceled. Did you find the berry? Oh, it's you. You don't look so happy to see me. Well, aren't you even going to serve me some tea? Serve yourself! Shove off while you're at it. <sighs> Still have all this old junk. Why bother? And no smoking! Uh, this place hasn't changed a bit. Don't touch anything. A roll. If you're going to serve me a roll, surely you must also have Glide Bear Dion. All right, I'm a sprat. This is what, this jam's gonna knock your socks off. We're back! Whoa! You gave it away, someone was sick. Ugh, I suppose that does take precedence. Is it not ready yet? Shouldn't I be smelling something fruity by now? We're um, uh, just making it now. It'll be ready in flash. This is bad. Looks like we've got no choice. We're gonna have to use that. Um, that doo doo. What do you want? 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 Found it. We'll replace the berry with this. It's a meatball? Ghost peppers. Oh, that's gonna be fucking hot. Exactly. Ghost pepper jam. Be good to put a little bit of ghost pepper in, like maybe some mango jam. Maybe even like a strawberry or rad. 
no raspberry raspberry ghost pepper be fucking nice just a little a little heat with your sweets Ooh, hey now recipe time with agile steel new segment is this supposed to be jam where's the rich aroma the fruity bouquet uh, all those cigars probably ruin your sense of smell. Ah, uh, fudge. This color, isn't it a bit too vibrant for jam? You've never had jam this fresh before. <laughs> it's always like this. Uh, why do I feel a strange sense of foreboding? Ba -ba -ba, ba -ba -ba. It's just your growing excitement. Go on now, take a bite. Gonna be hot. Is this too hot? What? Why is it so spicy? <laughs> Silly. What's wrong with spicy, huh? It's a spice life after all. Mm, don't patronize me. They told me I'd be having glazy berry jam. All I got was this spicy mess. More like a spicy masterpiece. I'm back. Ba, 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 ba. No problem, so I'll pass the border. Oh, Lee's here. Mm, don't tell me that's Elvis spicy jam, is it? Is he? D t tell him how great my spicy jam is. I, uh, I mean, it's. <laughs> Why don't we just leave it at that now, then? I look forward to your next creation. Try not to disappoint. What a top dog baller. Big dick swinging all over the fucking town. Make me some jam. Walking into people's houses demanding shit. Here it is, look. It's Lily before it turned into a big boob. <laughs> wow, he was looker. What's he wearing? He almost looks like a Rocket Knight. Whoa, Rocket Knights are cool. Oh, he used to be a major Earthborn fanboy. <laughs> fanboy. All right, you don't know that word, do you? Just means somebody who's like a, an uber fan of something, to the point of being just a little crazy. <laughs> It's just, uh, one of the words from, like, ancient times. What about this? Is he a fanboy of this, too? Let me see, let me see. Oh, gosh, right. I, I completely forgot about this. What is it? What is it? The big dang crab pot. Lily used to go shit wild for that. Let's go get some crabs and fucking make it. We could explore that part of the map that hasn't been explored yet. It'll be perfect. John! Well, that's it. A big, big dang crab pot. We need to find a big dang crab and make the biggest dang crab pot he's ever seen. Oh. That's a great idea, Sam. That that person's still dead. All right. A handful of places we have explored. Oh, and it's right there. So, unsplored, unsplored. Oh, shit. And then there's that huge chunk on the other map that we can't see right now. A yo, 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 it's Chubbo at O Steel, reporting for poopy duty. The best type of duty. The poopiest. We are going to keep uh, not heading south, not heading north. 
Not even west, but eastward. It's a pretty good joke. It's a good bit. I'm going to do that every time now. All right, Captain Seaman. Hey, <laughs> come on now. Afraid today's stock already been bought up by that greedy land lover. But I've heard tell that the Dragon's Market, in its final stages of prep, perhaps you'll find a bit of luck there. Thanks, dude. Preach. Preach. Preach, yeah. Uh, yes, we get to go down there to the seedy side of town. All the scumbags. All the trash. The rough side of town. Could just play Earthborn. Eh. Another time. I know y'all love that. Where the fudge is the... Goon. Ooh, here we go. It's where you go to get drugs. Jerked off. Whoa. Well, you're sure too buffoon incompetence can handle it. Though you can stake your whole life on us, my man. We're only the strongest, smartest, studliest gents this side of the dang. Mr. Shelby, sir. We'll, uh, have all them king crabs to you tomorrow first thing. Scout's honor. Not sure what kind of scout you are or how this helps any, but, you know, why not? Porquois paws, am I right? Pork. Porqua, porqui, porqu, pas. Porqua pa. Porqua pa. Porqua pa. Porqua pa. Porqua pa. Um, it means, hey, why not? In French. Vocabulary time with Ads of Steel, our favorite segment. It's where we learn. Edutainment. This is a technically considered an edutainment channel for that reason. Get the fucking tax right off. I'll hire you for the job. The well, score, man. Uh, duh. Come on, bro. Let's go celebrate. Well, let's go stick my thumb up my butthole and smell it and then rinse and repeat like 70 or 80 times. Let's stick it the same thing, bro. I'll I got the perfect idea too. The, the butthole finger smell thing? Oh, <laughs> yep. That's what they were both thinking. <clears throat> Gross. Well, uh, them boys are not right. Let's grab you folks after. Come to Le Bonne Persone. <laughs> Stop by King Crab tomorrow. And you'll be able to partake in New Dang City's most exciting crab experience. And John, did you hear that? Let's go tell Alva. We're gonna win for sure tomorrow. All right. Crab extravaganza sounds fun as hell. Porco pa. Crab extravaganza. Porco pa. Why not? Why? Is this thing on? Uh, why is it blinking at me? What on earth? What on earth indeed? Ah, uh, Celeste girl, shit! You! How could... what? Uh, a bit slow on the uptake, are we? Isn't there something you want to say to me? For instance... What is going on here? Clearly, you really are nothing more than a child. Th th that's not true. I'm a harvester, a reaper of humanity. Is that so? And yet you couldn't even figure out how to turn this on. That, well, no matter. 
I'll give you a new toy to play with. Oh, fucking creepy Celeste Gross Pink Girl. I'd like that, wouldn't you? Mm, you don't mean. What does she mean? Porque pois. Let's go, John. We need to get the king crabs for the crab pot and take Lee down. All right. This is a good idea. Hold on a second. I have an idea. We shall play this. Is this a game machine? What? Oh, I wonder if I could play it later. That's the second, third, fourth time. Later is now. Mm. Hold on a second. You know, as a child, things are not always, always rosy. I think we can agree on that. Because you might have somebody that's like my father. Don't flush those toilets! I want you to leave those logs in there for me to inspect. Want to see them? I want to see what you've done. Inspection complete. Hope there's no turds in here. Nope, just food. Good. Inspection complete. Okay. Where is the crab party? Crab party. Yeah, all right. Do da do do da. Whoa, his hair got even bigger overnight. And when I, I was gonna say it looked stupid last time. You really want me to notice how stupid it is this time? Ah, hi, we're here to. I knew what you're looking for, you scurry dogs. Tis what everyone's waiting for. Tis a taste of the old king. Let me first meet Shivas. He left for the port, and they've been not a sign in since. Oh, man, I'm sorry about your hair and your first mate. John, let's go to the dragon market and take a look. Maybe something happened to him. That's a shifty side of town. All right, we're going back across the tracks. Carry yourself the right way. Make an appropriate amount of eye contact. Not too much, not too little. Don't make a target of yourself. Ah, cool. Woo! Oh, my. The dragon market's open. So, are you dumb or what? What the hell does that have to do with us? We don't got any money. Come on, people means more trash. Them trash bins are gonna pile up to the moon. <laughs> trash lady. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Well, I'll be smarter than you look. <laughs> Get that trash. A couple of town scavengers. Ooh, fuck. Apple, mouse, toad of the blight, cloth ladle, hair of the white. Drop them all in a great big pot. Near to go home without three drops. All right. Welcome, welcome, my friends. Feast your eyes upon new dang city's finest fish tails. Ooh, I like fish tails. Fish. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning, come all. Feast your eyes upon new dang city's finest fish heads. Ooh, more fish. See? Thank you. Mmm, a rare respite from work. Mm, the newly reopened dragon market. Mmm, truly a recipe for self-indulgence. Thank you, robot. Ooh, what ho, could be seeing things. The dragon market is actually opening again. Vile. Where's our... Ah. Yar. 
What am I going to do? What am I going to do? Oh, parvey de moi. Shavis, the captain's looking for you. Oh, little semi. You great, beautiful Bobby da Papa. Bobby da Papa. You got to hear me out. The captain sent me to pick up a shipment of crab. And I came straight here like all right, all of a tot. I did. Only what do you know? The dang ship was locked up tight as a portrait of derriere. Too much vocabulary for even ads of steel. Are the mariners stupidus? Flown the coop. The dumb fools left me looking like a fool. Oh, mariner stupidus. What's a mariner stupidus? No fucking clue, Sam. I'm sorry. It's too much for me to look up. I'll tell you what they are. I'll tell you good. Sort of those damn furries is what they are from Brother Construction. Oof. I don't know. Sounds like he might be saying some iffy stuff. He's gonna get himself cancelled. Or, or I mispronounced that. They told me to help and have the best crabs. La crumb de la crumb. Ugh. But now what? The Chevis does not bring home a bacon. Le bacon? Could they bring home a Chevis? Je serai vore. Damn. Guy is a dastardly homophobic Frenchman. We have to help him out to get this frigging crab. Shit. Oh, this guy has an exclamation point. Mm, you seek out to find the damn fairies. Keep calling people fairies. He's not politically correct. Okay, we have a homophobic robot as well. Maybe I should vocabulate that word. Probably means, or is pronounced in a different way. That would be the idiot brethren, Sylvia and Armstrong. Ah, the the brothers dumb. And Lightning Max, no doubt. A bar in the uptown, drinking away their troubles as always, and sniffing their fingers. They sniff my fingers, what? I don't know what that has to do with anything. Or what he exactly means by that. Let's go find these drunks. Let's go find these dumb drunks. <laughs> ah, fuck. Up, 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 and right. What's our, uh... What's our items look like really quick? Oh, we got three of that one thing. I think we can do an upgrade. Next time we find a shop with upgrades, I believe we can do... Like our next level gun or some shit. Probably that flamethrower. That, that thing's really smoking balls. I think that's been the strongest weapon so far. Pretty decent on ammo, too. Okay, they're passed out drunk. More clothes for today, bud. And don't ask me why. If you have to ask anyone, ask those two bozos over there. Came in moaning about some jackpot nonsense. And have been drinking themselves senseless since last night. <laughs> now they're passed out on my floor like a couple of dead oxes. Hmm. You, Liam. That's so. So they're those two, are they? See, it, that's like he talked there and gave information, but we didn't hear it. So he's not completely silent. We have to fill it in. Um, I guess I'll take over for Mung today and zap those two chumps into shape. Yowch. Wowie, the would you hit me, bro? All right, dummies. So it wasn't me, it was Mac. The would you sub us, Mister? You two forgot something important, did ya? Oh, money. We pay you monies for the drinks, didn't we? We did, didn't we, bro? The the king crabs. We forgot about the king crabs. 
We're done for. Come on, bro. We gotta motor ourselves to the dragon market. Oh, man. Gotta run back over there now. Do you recognize those two back there? Do. Uh, anyone who's been drinking in broad daylight isn't one who we to associate with. <laughs> those two can't do anything right. Anyway, you guys better hurry to Dragon Market yourselves. Demand for those king crabs is about to go through the roof. Shit, we gotta get there. Gotta get this freaking crab running us all over town. We're so sorry, Chief Soul Pyre. Oh, though, so sorry. Oh, mine's Ifon. You damn fools lost Shivas' job. Oh, we're so sorry. Super sorry. I don't want your sorrows. I want your asses hauling that crab up to the shop. All is it? Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right. A summer man I know I could count on you too. The uppermost the matter say but cool. More of me. I had think back to King Crab to make sure those imbeciles don't try anything else. We got time. What's that by yourself you hear? I've got the Ray Campolo songs and cry a ball. With your name on it. What the fuck is this guy talking about? Jeez, man. Charles Waz. All right, maybe we can find a shop. So let's hit a couple of these places on the uh, way back real, real quick. Piss. I want to talk to that dude. Ah, those two fuckers. Those two fucks. Oh, I'm just a landlord. Okay, not the upgrade shop. I swear there was one in this town. I could be getting towns confused, but I'm pretty sure there's one in every town. Check this out. Another one of these dead goblin thingies. Yeah. Oh, so we meet again. Mm, scary ghost. Let me ask you something. It's Ellie. Pretty normal looking Ellie. Mm. You wouldn't be the first to think so. Picture this. The sun going down on a warm summer's day. Kids saying goodbye to his friends. Hi home for the night. Just like any other day. Ancient to eat his mom's freshly grilled burger. He decides to take a shortcut. Oh, how gloriously cool the alley feels after the muggy streets. He starts going faster. His little shoes slap, slap, slapping the pavement. Slap, slap, slap. And he runs. The alley seems to shrink tighter and tighter. Besides, the alley we're closing in. Till he has to turn sideways just to keep moving forward. The only thing on his mind is his mother's burgers. Faster, he thinks. No need to. I need to hurry. Hurry, hurry. He keeps pushing and squeezing and inching until he can push and squeeze and inch no more. So to say, you can still hear him, unable so much as to turn his head as he calls out for his Mimo again and again. Mimo! Mimo! What a fucking terrible story. Way to bring the mood down, bro. Prick thing to do. We're all having fun here, but whatever. This dude, I think he might. Fucking real cool art on this guy. I like the character design big time. And another short shark at. See you, Till. Forgive me if I'm a little short with you. Hey. hey. All right. 
Okay, so we can get the flame upgrade. Fuck yeah, that's exactly what we want. Bombs, we're not using as much. This we don't have, but I would love to get the ammo expansion eventually. It costs a different currency though. Would this be a level three flame? I think we're already level two. Level three, hell yeah! It's gonna be badass. We need to get that uh, ammo upgrade next. Sweet. All right, that was worth it. That was worth tracking down. Oh, little Sammy, bon de Ah, the reward I promised inside. The Pesh Mode. La Capitan wants to give the whole bushel of Greek crabs. Whoa. Better save. After good news like that. Better believe we're gonna save. I knew you'd be back in a jiffy. What say ye? Try to tantalize ye tongues on the flesh of the crab. Flesh of the king, old crab. I got a whole bushel full for you right here. Can you really give us all those crabs? Without your help, these king crabs would have been meeting with Davy Jones. Suffocated to death, that would have been. Should be me, what's thanking you? Take them. Take them all. Crab party. Sean, we got the king crabs now. Let's, let's hurry back to Rocket Mansion. Back this way. Get here any minute. The dough, big or small? Oh no, oh, we don't have enough ginger. Oh, <laughs> the crabs are running around. Oh, I've ate my pudding. Crap, 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 crap. <laughs> See, I'm saying crap. The crabs are getting away, John. Oh, leave it to me. Grab a crab. 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 I think that's all of them. Grab a crab. That's all. I hope you like them. Crabs. One, two, three, four, five, six. Sean, I got all the crabs. Something smells good in here. Have you guys already started cooking? Lily's totally going down this time. Jaws up. The troop. Oh, we haven't seen him forever. I thought he was gone. The troop's done for. You must help us. If tonight's show is a rousing success, well, 
we'll be forced to leave New Dang City. Don't sweat it. The Rocket Knight, need, Rocket Knight Legion is on the job. Rocket Knight Legion, sweet! Sounds just like Earthborn. I just fucked it up while walking through the door. Pretty good, don't you think? Don't worry, Jasper. Rocket Knight Legion is going to make everything right again. Where to next? We're overdue for an action sequence. Some battles. Let's head up there and see what's going on. The circus side of town. All the carnies. You hear that, you good for nothings? I need that money and I need it today. I didn't just raise the rent on us like that. At least give us a bit more time. Uh. You two bit hack jobs. I could give you ten years and you never pay back that money. You don't pay me what you owe me, well. You better start packing your bags. You hear me? Y'all be out. <laughs> what are you looking at? Out of my way. Rude dick. Have a fear, my friends. I've returned. And look who I've brought. It's over already. We're finished. No ifs, ands, or buts. We don't pull off a miracle tonight and we're out of here. Better start thinking about what we'll do after we leave. No, but you guys can't go. I'll never be able to eat your ice cream again. Sorry, little one. It's not like we want to go. Almost as it had we known this would be the conclusion. Perhaps we never would have come to this city at all. Quite all of you. What kind of performer abandons their own audience? And Jasper got punk. I can't agree. I mean, how can we just abandon our audience, huh? Well... So what are we waiting for? Let's practice like the Dickens. Then show this city just what the Fantasia train is made of. <sighs> the worry isn't unwarranted. If we open tonight's show in our current state, it will be nothing short of a disastrous disaster. We must help us. There must be something we can do. so sad. Mine is a tale of war, I'm afraid. Name's Dorcas. And I'm Malorcus. Dorcas Malorcus. <clears throat> no one asked you. I'm a clown here in the truth. As if that weren't obvious. I used to have that called Boxes of Fright. Fright is right. Those creepy dolls you had popping out of the boxes. Or enough to haunt kids' dreams. You should have seen all the complaints we got from parents. 
That's why I'm changing it. Yes, I have a new act now. A real showstopper, I call it. The slight is right. I like the slight is wrong. <laughs> Where this guy is concerned, his hands are as slow as molasses. Even a baby would be able to see through that awkward mess he calls an act. I don't need to hear that from you. And yet I know he's right. My hands just aren't nimble enough to pull off the trick. Oh, let me see. Maybe I can do something to help. Really? Would you watch my act? I'm a joy of joys. Don't be too harsh on him. His pride's as brittle as an eggshell. Here it goes. Not too hard at this point, right? Now watch this. Had a jumble, is it? <laughs> but wait, there's more. Now, where do you think the ball is? Is that your final answer? Are you sure? I wasn't even really paying attention. <laughs> it was that easy. Oh, well, you're right. It's true, I really am awful at this. My hands are just too slow. Maybe I should just give up. Oh, well, thanks anyway for trying to help. Feel free to come back anytime. I'm always here. Can we find a way to make him faster? I really did it. Maybe I'm not horrible at this. Get his, get his confidence up a little bit. Thank you, truly. I feel on top of the world. Oh, my hands feel positively electric. Hey, Vertilli man. Uh, I'm actually a driver here. But lately, it seems more and more like we're going to get forced out. I miss that sweet lightning that lightning max the most. Hey, man. I guess I'd actually have something to do then. Groovy hippie dude. Just going with the flow. Well, hey there. Care to listen to ramblers on the old bus head? I miss troops. I'll start pitching, you know. Why would a circus troop need a pitcher? I'm glad you asked. My fastball is one of the most popular acts, you know. Throw it again, Cage. Rage and Cage, the star shooter. That's what they call me. Couldn't get enough of my white red streaks. And our business <clears throat> and our audience begin to wane. I found myself pitching less and less. Part where I was losing my touch, a rusty pitcher. Could it get much worse? But what do I do? I don't have anyone to practice with. This fastball's just too well fast. John, why don't you get a try? You could help him. You think you got what it takes to hit my fastball? Of course. Well, I'll be. Some are finally willing to go up against my fastball. Let's get things fired up. Oh, it's fast. Oh, it's fast. Oh. 
Got it. Oh, yeah. Get the fuck out of here. Slow down my fastball just so you can hit it. That defeats the whole purpose. Let's try again. I got this. Shit. Fuck! Fucking out of the park, bro. Woo-wee! It's feeling, it's feeling. It's like all the passion, all the pan-fried pizzazz. Pass straight into my palm. That's the stuff. That's the feel I've been missing. Crowds will be shouting my name again tonight. Glad to help, bud. Beautiful for some Earth. Wind. For hire. No, no, no. Again. From the top. <laughs> Excuse me. Is there any way perhaps I could be a help? Hmm? Oh, it's just you, Jiang. Oh, what? Don't tell me you want to join, do you? I'm uh, uh, not quite sure that would work. Perhaps if we got a, t a change of attire. You know, to exaggerate things a little. Oh, brilliant idea. Yeah, but where are we going to get something like that? We don't even got money to put food on the table. <laughs> I've got just the ticket. The perfect costume. On the second floor of the Coin Palace. Find some paraphernalia. Mm, you think the two of us could grab it for you? Ooh, why not purchase yourself? I have my reasons, you know. Besides, uh... We gotta practice, right, boys? D didn't you just go there the other day, though? Maybe he was looking for the costume. No, he was going there to meet some woman. What was her name? Lily. That's right, Lily. How'd things go with her, anyway? Would you two shut up? <laughs> Razzin. Anyways, simple job. You guys should be fine. Find the stuff on the second floor of the Corn Palace. Should be three pieces total. You can't miss them. Just leave it to us. All right, so there was that place way up there. I'm gonna go pop off a save really quick first. Let's get this saved up for a second before we complete this quest. Yeah, all right, let's go, all right, let's go. 
Hey now, hey now, let's go. All right. Hold on a second. Wet bandits! Ha <laughs> ha! Take that! Let's get out of here before someone sees us. Oh, who's this fucking weirdo? Woo! So, I toss so, so tired. Hey, you pretty able looking fella. Think you can help another fella out? I don't know, dude. You see that curvaceous goddess over yonder? Oh, the big girl? She's pretty rotund. That's the one! Okay. Um, her adorable antics, her inspiring voice. Her rotund tum. Up, I'm absolutely smitten. My love for her grows every passing day, as does her BMI. Whoa, come on, dude. Just bask in her beauty. Look at me. I'm like a stick. I'm ever supposed to carry her across the aisle. And no matter how much I train, I can't make a lick of progress. Steroids. I've heard tell of a food called hamburger. One bite of it will turn you into a hunk. The girls will go wild for. You don't think you could help a guy out and get me a hamburger? If you need to know the recipe, just ask Mikey. Apparently back where he's from, they eat hamburger all the time. He's just got to know how to make one. He's a big guy with a green stash -o. Probably at the Coin Palace. He's been hanging out there lately. Ah, a ne'er-do-well degenerate gambler, huh? Well. Go find this degenerate. Oh, hey. What's up, bosoms? What? I don't know if that's a green stash. It's more blue. Blue. This is the JBs. Oh, uh, I think there might be some stuff hidden in the JBs, though. supposed to come back here that's right this mask it must be part of the costume just two pieces left hey you gotta be around here somewhere all right Sam chill out calm down what oh, what's a, what a pretty wig just one piece left Oh man, this is a CD. There's tissues. Terrible CD place. Just absolute filth. It's gotta be a whip. <sighs> the Beetle Queen. Okay. That's it, all the pieces of the costume. Come on, John, let's head back. Let's get the fuck out. Was there a butt plug on there? Jesus. Inappropriate much? Cheese. Cheese with the side of Louise. All right. You got a blue mustache, but. What's that? You want to make a hamburger? <laughs> it's only the easiest, tastiest dish around. Gather round, folks. I'm about to impart on you the knowledge that you seek. What? Burger set. Check out your recipe. Check it out. Let's go cook us some sweet hot meat. What kind of meat do you got? 
I got that sweet meat. Give me that sweet meat. Give me that sweet meat. All I want to eat is sweet meat. Give me that sweet meat. Give me that sweet meat. Because all I want to eat is sweet meat. What bandits? Let's see if we can cook hamburguesa recipe. Ooh, hamburguesa. Seafood, meat, fruit. Seafood doesn't go in there, nor does fruit. That's real fucking stupid. Hmm. Seafood, meat, fruit. Seafood. Damn. We need a meat. Oh, hold on, we can look here. Egg, that's a meat. Seafoods, seafoods. Damn, we need another meat. Find some meat. Eh, all right, let's just do this first. Oh, you folks did it! I knew asking you two was the right choice. That's it. What you want me to wear? It's a little bit um revealing. Now you say it's embarrassing. Well, these kind of folks went all the way to Coin Palace to go and get it for you. You were the one who wanted to help. Lung Jung. Just put it on, Lu Jung. Truly, these delicate garments would weep at losing the chance to adorn your form, milady. Ooh, okay, just uh, give me a moment, please. Yeah. Yeah, put this on. Yeah. On your knees! <laughs> Brilliant! Did I say you could speak, Worm? I am the Beagle Queen! I can't thank you enough for retrieving this custom for me. Yes, perhaps some sort of reward is in order. Oh, no need to worry. It won't be anything too painful. Just leave tonight's performance to me. The men in this city won't know it hit them. Yes, ready as sticks, boys, because tonight the tent shall rise. Wow, who knew Jai Yang was so eloquent? Sweet hoo, my buns. Who is the Chung you speak of? I'm the Beetle Queen. All right. How utterly splendid! I knew you two would pull through. Tonight's carnival is going to be a smashing success. I just know it. However, there is one thing I still need you to do. Yes, a job of utmost importance. An important job? What is it? What is it? <laughs> Taking tickets? Welcome. Hey there. Got a smile, son. You got a smile.
You're welcome. John's just growling. Welcome. Welcome. Oh, it's Mong. Well, if it isn't him, Majesty's little pea. You going to the carnival too? No, I gotta work. Aren't you responsible? Hoo-hoo! Good luck with that. Welcome. Dude, what a rip-off. What a sweet rip. And now, taking to the stage, Kitty, the ferocious jungle cat, and her trainer, El Tigre. Can we go watch now? Okay, gotta work. Oh, it's this person. Welcome. Well, hello there, Sonny, for the circus. Hmm, weird kid. Yeah, something fucking is up with that dude. Now the fastest on this side of the dang. This steel-armed wonder raging cage, Olson. Raging cage. What a rush. He's got a puke. I want to watch. It's so boring. Can't I just watch for a bit? What? We're a crab hot. Spring. Overcooked. How disappointing. They've actually been able to recreate that crab pot. <laughs> I might have actually been forced to throw in the towel. It seems Lady Luck is on my side. <laughs> Lately's not gonna know what hit him. You never in a million years expect that John can make his beloved big dang crab pot. Ah, lovely. Here comes the migraine. Ooh, wait, is that a cigar I smell? Lily's already here. You haven't touched anything, have you? If you sabotaged all John's hard work. Oh, you've done a far better job at that than I ever could. What? How dare you? You dirty dog. You think you can't just walk out of here? This is the big dang crab pot, your favorite. Yes, yes, um, and let me just ask you one thing. What's the most vital thing to remember for a successful crab pot? Uh, just the right amount of time in the pot, of course. Oh. We fudged up. I've seen enough. Though I am a bit hungry for some crab now. I'll need to have my chef cook me a replacement. Tut, tut, tut. Harumph. Harumph and tut. Man, that guy's harumphing pretty friggin' hard. You dare tut tut her rump me. Lee! What? You have a gun with you. You have one chance left. Oh, I'm John. I don't say anything. I got fucking fell down a well and got kicked by a horse. <sighs> Are you even taking this seriously? You've yet to produce even a single dish I can actually eat. If I had, if you had time to go play around at the circus, why not put those heads to good use? And actually think up something good. Tut tut. Harumph. What a dickhead. Just trying to be nice and cook good dishes. 
next time. Next time you're going down. Come on, chat. Let's head back inside. All right. We can still eat this, right? Uh, we don't have any taste buds, maybe. Oh, but it was only barely overcooked. Can't be that bad. Do you not remember the time you ate those mushrooms? Playing around at the circus? Who does he think he is? We weren't playing around. Hmm. What's that smell? Smell? Oh, you mean the crab pot? Oh, fudge. Is this John's crab pot? How did it turn out so... Oh, you didn't add something weird to it, did you? Hey, my cooking isn't that bad. It's just overcooked. Those crabs are a little like, delicate. Really easy to overcook them. Oh, I guess we'll have to try again tomorrow. I wouldn't if I were you. If I don't leave, he's already gorging himself on crab pot right now. Ugh, without that spark of pure, unadulterated childlike surprise, I just don't know if it'll have the same effect. What? What, the, what are we gonna do? I don't know what you're waiting for. Just go knock. But then it's a dang princess's house. Who's out there? Who is it? Uh, we're here to see John and Sam. Could we come inside? Uh, of course you may. Just don't let the smell... Don't let the smell bowl you over. Oh, it's you guys. Holy wells, though. This is the princess's house. Oh, it's ginormous. Huh? You can have everybody from the troops here, too. Ring, doo, doo, doo. Somebody slapped me with a dead fish. What does that smell? I'm having visions of Jasper's socks. Hmm. <laughs> oh, it's just our crab pot. Our slightly overcooked crab pot. Too. Oh, the health person's house with the pink. It smells like cookies or fairy dust or something. <laughs> right on your bum. Quiet. Everyone wants your pitiful appraisal. Smack your bums. The show. How did the show go? It was a booming success. Oh, wow, gosh, oh, wow. That means you guys can stay, right? You don't have to leave. Indeed, which just leaves your little problem. Our little problem? Yes, Jasper already filled us in. He said the two of you had gotten yourself embroiled in a little wager with Lee. You folks sure got balls of steel going up against the Lee. Only New Dang City's most curtastic crime lord. Real son of a snake, that was. At any rate, seems like the perfect time for a troop to step in and save the day. Lily's not really that bad. <sighs> so cute. Lily. You could say the same for her body. <laughs> oh, we're not talking about the little kid, it's the older one. Ah, smack on the ass anyway. Smack on the ass again. Don't say that. What I meant to say was, um, gifts. We brought gifts. Gifts to help you wipe that smug grin off Lee's face. You mean all of this is for us? Holy cow, this is amazing. Is this snow plain cactus? Wow, I've never seen this in the flesh before. Stupid pandas. Princess has such a keen intuition. <laughs> and this cheese, it looks a little weird. It's cheese from my hometown. Not just any cheese. This is hard rock cheese. Whoa, well, these are called fright shrooms. They're so good, 
I'll give you a frat. What, no good? Ooh, dumb Dorcas and Melorcas. They look like normal mushrooms. This, this, this is amazing. Now we're gonna win for sure. Quick, quick, John. We gotta get cooking. Ooh, we're gonna cook a feast. Cook it up, cook it up. Cook it up, cook it up. Oh, that smells so good. It certainly looks more appetizing than our previous attempts. Oh, rabble, 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 rabble. But I still can't help but feel that we're missing a yes factor. Ultimate clincher. I found them. Oh, it's Jasper. Allow me to introduce the great, the brilliant, Willem the Merchant. Oh, and his assistant, Daniel. Oh, these fuckers. We meet again. You guys know each other? We first met on board Kara. We also gave him the glazy berries yesterday. That's not suspicious at all. Don't worry. We're not trying to trick you this time. What? Let me do the talking, please. Um, after hearing that our magna magnanimous benefactors had found themselves in a crisis, we thought it only right to offer a recompense of sorts. And the suspicion grows. Let's just hear what they have to say. Just hear that sweet beat. Uh, have you fine ladies of her quick value? You mean the dump? Yes, 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 yes. It's developed that uh, alias, as it were. There's a lot of earthquakes there. So people call it Quake Valley. And not just any quakes, you see. If my intel is correct, those quakes were caused by a rather rambunctious creature known as a tambalor fish. Oh. Yeah, but that thing's not edible. An astute observation, my dear princess. I see you've done some research of your own. <laughs> well, mostly thanks to Izzy. But if any of you ever give it any thought as to why that fish causes... Tremolous, tremulous, tremulous trembles. We're still not really sure. Maybe it's got an itch. Oh, oh, and because it doesn't have hands, it can't scratch it. Oh, an excellent hypothesis, Sam. You may be a scientist yet. A flawed conclusion, I'm afraid. No, no, the reasoning behind this is more gluttonous. Did you know the fish are quite sensitive when it comes to earthquakes? Even the slightest tremor will send them hopping and skipping atop the water's surface. Yeah, but uh, what does that have to do with anything? Has everything to do with everything. For you see, our gourmandizing friend uses these quakes to dine on its pristine brethren. What a smart fish! Indeed, indeed. But what's next is key to this whole affair. The bulk of this fish's diet, you see, consists of a fish so delicate, so delectable, so dreamy. Why, you'd never want to partake of any other fish again. The Golden Valley Snapper. <gasps> yeah, 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 we, we, we all know that. The thing's basically primo when it comes to gourmet cuisine. Golden Valley Snapper smells like lilies. And tastes sweet as ha 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 honey. It's flesh is tantalizing texture that dances in your mouth. And not only that, it's full of nutrients too. Creme de la creme when it comes to fish. Quake Valley's diamond in the rough. That fish sounds amazing. The only problem is it's very crafty. You can't catch it like normal fish. 
Only the Templar fish has ever been able to catch it. Putting two and two together then, it would seem our task is simple. If we find the tremor fish, we find our snapper. Wait just a minute here. Who, who said we'd agree to any of this yet? Of course, whether you choose to set forth on this venture is completely up to you. Yet I cannot be the only one thinking that your choices are... Shall we say limited? I gotta admit, I got a pretty fierce hankering for Snapper now. I've always wanted to give that golden fish fiend a try. And Quake Alley sounds like a, a super cool place! Marvelous, marvelous. Then it seems you've already made your decision. Shall we meet, say, tomorrow morn at the big station? I do hope you all have a wonderful night's sleep. Sweet dreams. A ta ta. Don't you ta ta me. I will ta your ta ta. Harumph. I will tut tut your ta ta. He rump. What? John, you're finally up. Well, we gotta get going pronto. Daniel and William are already waiting for us at the big station. Fuck yeah. About time for some adventure. Been good exploring and good story and town questing. It has been actually quite funny. Some silly, bunch of silly goose antics these last couple episodes. Now we're gonna get some sweet action. Let's go smash some butts. Oh man, I've been looking to crush some butts all day. Nice butt you have there. Be ashamed if somebody crushed it. <laughs> you better believe I'm gonna crush this butt. After I talk to this robot. Belly dangerous. Make sure you're well prepared. That's what it says on the paper. Thanks, Mr. Robot. Alright. I think we're prepped, right? I reckon it is good advice. We should see. Ah, shitty. Damn. I wish we had a little bit more. Oh. Oh, 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 right. You know what? With where we're at timing wise and how much time I have left, I'm just gonna call this. We got a video here for sure. Let's go save um, and then be a nice little cliffhanger. We'll come back with the start of the next episode. Going right into an action scene. Going right into this dungeon like area. Find this dang old tasty fish, club it right on its butt. Knock it unconscious. Cook that bitch up. Folks, I hope you're enjoying. I'm having a blast with this one. We're really uh, uh, starting to pick up the pace now that this is our solo game. Shy of Gungeon and whatever sessions distract me. But our solo long play walkthrough game. Um, appreciate the support. The subscriptions have been going up. I've about doubled in the last couple weeks. As I've been doing a little bit of marketing. But you people have been with me from the beginning. I cannot thank you enough. I will not forget it. I am in your debt. And and really, really appreciate it. Make sure to like, comment, sub. Let your friends know. Let everybody know. You know, take out ads. In an email spam campaign. All the stuff we've covered in past videos mobilize 
Thank you, folks. Appreciate you. See you in the next one. Thank you. And he was polite. He would always say, thank you. He coined the term. People, everybody's saying it now. Well, Ya no